In this video, I'll be talking about the Master of Psychological Science majoring in Business Psychology program offered at the James Cook University Singapore campus. If you're familiar with JCU Singapore, you might know that they also offer a Master of Psychology clinical program. If you're more interested in that program, check out the video over here. Basically, between these two programs, the course you enroll into and the pathway you will take depends on your goals. As I'm sure you can guess by the name, if you want to work in mental health, the clinical psychology program will be better for you, while the business psychology program will be better suited for those looking to take on business-related functions like marketing, HR, or simply just management. Now, let me take a moment to talk about what business psychology is. According to the Association for Business Psychology, business psychology is the study and practice of improving working life. It combines an understanding of the science of human behavior with the experience of the world of work to attain effective and sustainable performance for both individuals and organizations. Now let's do a quick comparison of the Master of Psychological Science majoring Business Psychology and the Master of Psychology Clinical. There are two major differences between these programs. The first thing you should know is that the Business Psychology program is not a professional qualification. Graduates of the program cannot register as a psychologist in Singapore or Australia. Second, the Master of Psychological Science majoring in Business Psychology is purely a master's by coursework. Unlike the clinical psychology program, it will not include a supervised practicum component, any training in assessments, or any training in interventions and counseling. To put it simply, the two programs have different goals. The clinical program is designed to train practicing clinical psychologists, while the business psychology program trains you to apply psychology across a range of professions. At the time of filming, it seems that the Singapore campus of James Cook University is the only institution to offer a business psychology program in Singapore, but feel free to correct me in the comments if I'm wrong. As to why anyone would take up a Master of Psychological Science majoring in Business Psychology, I would say it could be more versatile than a typical MBA or a Master's in HR, for example. Especially if you're coming to this already with a Business Management or a Business Administration degree or a HR degree. Just take note that JCU will require those without a Psychology degree to complete a Graduate Certificate of Psychological Science before they can progress to the Master's. Here are the fees for the Grad Cert and the masters. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out via inquiries hyphen singapore at jcu.edu.au. Hey, thanks for watching till the end of the video. If you found value in this content, please help me out by liking the video. And if you haven't, please subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications as well.